Hey everybody, it's Rich at RMO Diag, and today we've got something a little bit unusual. I've had to take uh, the whole motor out of a Renault Zoe here, 65 plate. Uh, this is the 90 horsepower one. And what we've got is I had codes for uh, the excitation um, module, it said, and uh, the excitation on the um, on the motor. So that was a P0. 820 and P0821. So, what I've had to do is I've stripped everything down. So, you've got this whole unit here, which usually would sit on the top. This is where your charging comes in. You've got stuff for your, for your aircon. I believe that is for a heater for cold climate stuff. That's where your main power comes in. And we've got all this stuff in here. Uh, there's an inverter module which has been changed on this one 2022, I think it said on there. Yeah, various other stuff, bus bars and Anyway, not worried about that. So what I did is we had to split the motor here to get to the end of the shaft. As you can see, on these are the exciter rings. And you see this outer one here. It's absolutely wrecked. You see all this rubbish dropped down in here. So I think that is definitely our fault. This part can be changed from where these um, main cables come in. Cut the wires here, goes up in here. So these brushes are probably trashed as well inside here. We're going to need to do something with this, whether it is going to be a another motor or a second-hand motor, or whether we can actually buy parts and press it on, I don't know. And also, my other phone is ringing, so they're going to get ignored. Um, on the other side, I, I, I wasn't sure at the start, to be fair, You've got this other ring on this side, which I believe is for position sensor. Um, so yeah, just a bit of an interesting one. I don't know what else I might do on this or might show on this, but um, yeah, just a bit a bit different for me. I don't mind doing EV stuff, um, but this is the later type engine as well. I say engine, motor. So um, yeah, don't see so many of these, the earlier ones. Um, see various sort of trouble with them but right so just a quick one showing we've got this apart now and you can see the damage on the ring a bit better there and what's happened is you see this brush pack part going in and out nicely this one is stuck and it's been hot and obviously that's our issue so apparently this is a whole motor this can be bought separately this cannot so uh, this is going to need another motor putting in it likely um, and I obviously would advise to, to put this in at the same time and the new seals and blah 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 But hopefully we can get this um, back on the road for not too much money if we can maybe find a second-hand motor or something like that in good condition Right, so just as a bit of added diag me just trying to sort of think about how I can do this better next time um, I mean, yeah, I did pull this all out out of a bit of interest. We would have needed it for the repair anyway but this set of contacts here, if you've got the vehicle powered down, everything's nice and safe, you can get to that underneath the car through this plate here. So this plate bolts on underneath. So I've got multimeter continuity, both of these are on. Now that in its stuck state obviously isn't making contact with the copper, but if I push it onto it, you get continuity through both of those wires so whether that might be a good test to do before having to remove everything in the world to get to this just as a bit of a confirmation just get these two wires off and see if there's continuity through it probably worth worth a, a quick go before you get too carried away right so here it is in all its glory we have got the little pack off there this is off four bolts I think it was around the outside four or five bolts and there was one inside of that little bit there um, it was quite tight on a bearing to lift it up it doesn't really matter on this one because uh, it's not getting reused um, but there we go right up against it and as you can see it comes down attached to windings on the magnets and stuff in here um, so yeah that's it finished We'll find another one and um, get this back on the road with them, but 
uh, yeah, just out of interest on this one. Uh, cheers, guys. See you on the next one.